This is my presentation for the design of our school garden. I am going to talk about why a school garden is important, the important things that should be in the design, and finally, what I think it should look like. I researched school gardens and found some news reports where the students mentioned many positive things. These are some of the ones I agreed with. In particular, the respect that we develop for plants and the environment when we learn how they grow and the important part they play in keeping us healthy. Through my research, I have settled on nine key features for my school garden. Each one plays an important part. A water tank is important for when we are in drought. We can store the water when we have rain and we are not relying on the town water. Four garden beds will let us grow more variety of vegetables or fruit. We could also give a different class in the school responsible for a garden bed. A compost bin might also let us look at food waste in the school. We could teach some of the students on how to recycle food for our plants. The chickens can also provide eggs for our school, which can use in the canteen or sell to help us buy new plants. The fences will keep everything secure. There are lots of different animals like foxes and wild dogs, which could hurt our chickens, but cats and possums could destroy our plants. Our garden can be a peaceful place. Some students don't like playing handball or football at lunchtime, but they would like to sit in a garden and talk with their friends. Different plants need different things at different times of the year. A shade house will help us to grow seedlings in the right environment. A shed is important for safety. Garden tools can be heavy and sharp and should only be used when adults or teachers can help us. This is a sketch of my garden design. I used an aerial view so I can easily show you all of the different parts. Placing things in certain positions is important. You can see the water tank is next to the shed to catch the water runoff. The compost bin is closest to the garden so we don't have to carry it too far. The paths are important because they allow people to move around the garden bed safely. All of the parts to my garden fit inside the space that we have to build it. I used my drawing of the garden to build a model out of recycled material. The model helped me see if my design would still work when it moved from a 2D drawing into a 3D model. It could only fit two garden beds in and no shed. Next time I need to think about the size of my objects on the space that I have. I think my design is an improvement on our school garden. With more garden beds and thinking about how we can save the water, I think the new items I have, like chickens and a compost bin, will help our garden thrive.